This problem involves finding a missing test score. In a certain math class, students take five tests. A student received scores of 75, 80, 88, and 93 so far. What does he need to score on the last test to average an 85 overall? Now to find the average of a set of numbers, what do you do? You add them all together and divide by how many there are. That will give you the average or the mean. So you add them together and divide by how many there are. We have five tests in this problem. So we need to add up all the test scores, divide by five, and we want our average to be 85. So let's do that. So I'm going to add up all the test scores, 75 plus 80 plus 88 plus 93. Now what do we do with the fifth test score? We don't know what that score is. That's what we're trying to find. So anytime you have an unknown, we put in a variable for it. Let's just put in x. We're going to divide by how many test scores there are. 5. We want our average to be 85. Okay, so here we have one problem with an unknown variable, x. We want to figure out what x is equal to to make this equation true. So our first step is to add up all the numbers on top of the fraction here. 75 plus 80 plus 88 plus 93. That adds up to 336. Carry down the x, so 336 plus x, divided by 5, equals 85. Okay, so from here we need to solve for x. The next step I want to do is I want to multiply both sides by 5. And I do that because I want to get rid of this 5 on the bottom here. I want to get rid of everything else on this side besides the x. So the first step is to get rid of the 5. So I multiply both sides by 5. That ends up canceling out the 5 on the bottom. Leaving with 336 plus x equals, and we got 85 times 5. That's equal to 425. Now from here, to get x by itself, we need to get rid of this 336. So we subtract 336 from both sides. It leaves with x equals 89. So let's review that. So to find the average of a set of numbers, add them all up and divide by how many they are. In this case, we have five numbers, but one of them we don't know. So we replace that number with x. So we add up all together, divide by 5, we want the average to be 85. So we add up all the numbers that we have on top for the test scores, 75 plus 80 plus 88 plus 93, that's 336. So you have 336 plus x over 5 equals 85. Now we need to isolate the x to get x by itself. So I multiply both sides by 5 to get rid of the 5 on the bottom. 5 over 5 is 1, so essentially it cancels out the 5 on the bottom. Multiply the right side by 5, so we get 336 plus x equals 425. Subtract 336 from both sides, it leaves you with 